Welcome, boys and girls. Fitness world, we got workout. We got glutes, back, and abdominals. Three of my all-time favorite muscle groups. We are going to warm up. Start with the deep squats. I'm going to assume a little bit wider stance. My normal stance would be about right here. I'm going to do a little bit wider today because we're doing sumo squats. Holy cow, I'm tight. Oh, it ran 10 miles again yesterday. I think that's just been my, that's been my thing, running 10 miles. I did an ab workout oh, in the morning. I hit the heavy bag for 30 minutes, and then I ran 10 miles in the evening. So stretch out. Oh, my hips are tight. My legs are tight. My ankles are tight. I always want to stretch out. That's why I love starting with the squat. Let's do a few reps. So sumo squat reps. Feet are nice and wide. Toes are out. You go about parallel. My thighs are parallel to the floor. You don't have to go like all the way down like this, you know, uncomfortable. Just about parallel. Squeeze the glutes. Squeeze the ass on the way up. From the side, from your back is nice and straight. I'm not leaning in, right? I'm not overarching my back. It's just as bad. It's nice and straight. Right? Oh, I feel that feels good. Again, we're talking about intensity in our warm-up. Give me some rows. Grab some lightweight. Give me some rows. Intensity in the warm-up should be very low. Low intensity warm-up. Focusing on the muscles. Right? Squeezing my back. Nice and controlled. So we're doing back. So I love to warm up the back. We do legs and warm up the legs. We do back, warm up the back. This feels great. Let's warm up the core. Give me some V-ups. My abs have been feeling real good. I know your abs are feeling good. Been hitting core all week. Nice and controlled V-ups. Nice and controlled. And the first 30 minutes of the workout aren't going to be as intense as the last 30 minutes. It usually takes me about 20, 30 minutes for me to fully warm up. Let's flip and plank. I love doing plank for a warm up. Oh, feels good. Warm up those inner abs. Let me get my timer going so I see how long we're doing these things for. About a one minute plank. Flexing legs, flexing the butt, and flexing the stomach. All three of those muscles you should be flexing. Your quads, the legs, the butt, and the stomach. Oh, I'm feeling it. You're going to hear me making a lot of noises today. I'll tell you that much. I am sore. Give me 10 more seconds. Let's go right in the side. Like, hitting all parts of the core. Just give me a little bit of movement. Up and down. Again, today, this workout structure, we're doing 30 second rounds. 
30 seconds is very short. So what are we gonna be working on? Transition time and cutting down the transition time from exercise to exercise to one to two seconds. Now you don't wanna take 10, 15 seconds, switch sides. You don't wanna take 10, 15 seconds to transition. Not for this style. Maybe for another style, but not this week. Remember, a little movement up and down. Small movement. Flexing those obliques. Now we're going to go into Superman's now. So this is the lower back. So you get every part of the core. The Superman's, pull your body up and hold it. Point the toes away from the body. Pull the upper body up. Squeeze the calves, the hamstrings, the butt, the lower back, the middle back. Right? All these muscles. Oh, it feels great. I love this exercise. Very important. I'll give you reps up and down. Come down, come up. And let's do some burpees, just nice and slow and controlled. Remember, burpee, you're going down into a push up, coming up, pop the feet in, stand up. I'm not even going to jump with these burpees. I'm just working on mobility. Nothing crazy. Full squat, hands to the floor, pop the feet out, push up, pop the feet back in that same spot and stand up. Look at my feet. They always go to the same spot, here. Hands always go here. Pop the feet back in, look at the same spot. Up, down. It's not just a crazy cardio move. All right, my heart rate's up. Feels good, but I'm not dying. And I can still hold a conversation. This is how your warm up is. Deep breaths. We're gonna do some rotator cuff exercises, just like we did in our previous workouts this week. So grab some light weights. I'm gonna grab fives. I'm leaned in. I'm gonna pull my elbows up to the side and rotate. Again, rotator cuff exercises, super important. I call this one the scarecrow. Right, right here, right here. Now, Dig the elbows into the side and rotate those hands out like that. All right, see how my elbows are nice and tucked in? Doesn't have to be a big movement. You don't have to be swinging the weights up. Now give me some reverse flies. So straighten out those arms. Lift up to the side, bring it down. Nice and controlled. You see that pace? I bring it up, I hold it, bring it down slow. See this? Bring it up, hold it, bring it down slow. Good. 
Let's do some little bit of jump squats. Okay, let's jump in a little bit. Getting ready for this workout. You hear that crack? It's my knee cracking. Doesn't hurt. People are like, oh, why do joints crack? Just happens. Some say it's the release of carbon dioxide from the joints. Who knows what it is? They don't really know. As long as there's no pain associated with it, you're good to go. All right, guys, rest for a second and do what I'm doing. Look at that water. I want you to look at that water line. Yeah, we're talking about water. This water is going to be down to here at the end of the workout. This is a gallon. Oh yeah. I just said probably 10 ounces right there in my chug. The more water you drink, the easier you digest it so it's not sloshing around in your stomach. So get used to drinking water. All right, boys and girls. Show you this workout. This is what we got started here. So 30 second rounds. It's like I said at the top that you can barely read it. 30 second rounds. 30 second sumo squat. That's for the glutes, the butt. Right? This is our butt exercise. Then you're gonna hold it, pulse at 90 degrees. We'll do different variations of that. Then you got renegade rows. So core and back. Then you got man makers, which is a variation of the renegade row. You're gonna add push ups and a shoulder press to that, which we'll show you during the workout. And then we got side VFs for the obliques. Okay, we're gonna hit a lot of obliques today. So it's butt, back, and obliques for today. Already, keep up with me. I'm gonna be focusing on transitioning quickly. Okay, now we're gonna go through two sets and then I'm gonna give you a 30 second water break and then we're gonna finish with our final two sets, which are gonna be a little bit higher intensity on those final two sets. So the first set is gonna be warm up, second set, a little bit more intensity, drink some water, third set, higher intensity, fourth set, highest intensity. Okay. Again, we're working on the transition today. So transition quickly. <sighs> Let's get started. Oh. Get these final pieces together. I'm gonna start off body weight with my single squat. Okay, you can you don't have to start off body weight. I'm gonna start off body weight and I'll end with weight. All right, beginning in five, four, three, two, one, and begin. So feet nice and wide. You wanna think about making a house at the bottom position, right? Feet are nice and wide. You shouldn't be too narrow like this, right? Nice and wide stance. That's, that's a good stance right now. Right? Nice and parallel. My shins are perpendicular to the floor. My legs, my top of the thighs are parallel. So a nice 90 degree angle there, squeezing the butt as I push through. Now hold it at 90. Little pulses. Squeeze the butt. It's hard to do in this position, but you really gotta focus. It's like, wow, I'm burning. It's burning. Feels good. Holding it, pushing the knees out. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna fire it. Even just from that. And drop down, give me renegade rows. Push up position. Bro. Remember, transitions need to be quick. You don't wanna waste time. 30 seconds only. Five, four, three, 
two. And Mad Maker is a push up, renegade row, push up, renegade row, stand up, shoulder press, push up, renegade row, push up, renegade row, stand up, shoulder press. Now we got side V-ups. I'm on one side of my butt and I'm coming up. This hand is on the floor assisting me, trying to come up, touch the toes, control. Nice and controlled. No need to go fast yet. Switch sides, roll over to that other side. Again, no need to go fast. Just focus on that muscle group, the obliques. And hop up, sumo squat, I'm adding weight. Adding weight, and I'm going a little bit quicker. Squeezing my butt at the top. And hold it. Oh, I'm burning. Ten seconds. Oh, my goodness. And Renegade Rose, let's go. Transition fast. A little bit quicker reps. And Man Maker. Push up, row, push up, row, pop up, press, push up, row, push up, row, pop up, press. My goal is three in 30 seconds. This is my third. <sighs> Woo, just finished it. Let's go, V ups. Five dips, a little bit quicker pace. I'm sort of sweating now. All over. It's time. Switch sides, quickly, look at that, less than one second to transition. Oh my goodness, keep those feet up off the floor. Don't let them touch the floor, ever. You want those abs, baby, you want that six pack. Oh, I'm feeling that, right on those abs. About five, four, three, two, and I'm doing jump sumo squats, body weight, 30 seconds. Bring it in intensity up a little bit. Ooh, I should have gave you a water break. Oh, that's okay. We'll get through this round and then we'll water. How about that? Come on. Woo. 
I'm drinking water while I'm doing the pulse. While I'm doing that pulse. Oh my goodness. I'm on fire though. Woo! Come on, 10 seconds. Bowser. Five, four, three, two, and renegades. Come on. Love this one for the core, for the back, for the shoulders, for the chest, for the quads, the hip flexors, obliques. Oh my goodness. This one gets everything. And man maker, push, bro, push, bro, press. Okay, my goal is three. Push, bro, push, bro, press. Woo! And be ups. Side B-ups, let's go. Keep those feet up the whole time. Make sure you're going all the way down, all the way up. Woo! Five, four, three, two, Switch sides, keep those feet up. Keep those feet up. Oh, yes. Feel on this one on this side. Squeeze those obliques. Control those reps. Five, four, three, two, let's do plank. One minute play before our last set. A little bit of extra abdominal burn. One minute play. Because I feel my abs, baby, they burn. Feel good. Oh my gosh. Stick the butt up if you need rest, like me. My butt's up in the air. And I'm going back down. That's 30 seconds. You got 30 more. Oh yeah, now I'm feeling my abs. It's like a ripping. Flex as hard as you can. Flex as hard as you can. Oh, five second rest. Now flex as hard as you can. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. I'm flexing my abs like someone's about to kick me. Uh, my last five seconds. Flex, four, three, two, and hop up. We got jump weighted. Sumo squat. Let's go. Weighted jumps. See how we increased intensity there? Oh my goodness. Woo! I'm feeling it. And hold it. 90, give me some crunches like this. Crunch, 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 crunch. Oh, I'm burning. Ooh, my leggies are on fire. And renegade. Quick. I'm breathing heavy now. Oh my goodness. Wow. Get my butt up. Five seconds. 
And add that push up renegade, bro. I'm sorry, man maker. Push up, bro. Push up. Press. Press. And V ups. Let's go. Side V ups. Thirty seconds per side. Switch sides, roll over. Oh, yes. I love these ones. Hitting those obliques feels great. Oh. And give me regular V ups. It's double time. Oh my gosh. I'm on fire. Come on. Oh. Hold yourself under those legs. We need a little bit of rest. And then get back to it. Oh. Oh. 10 seconds. And play. Let's go one minute plank. Flex those abs. Take some deep breaths. Twenty seconds. Ten times. Woo! That felt great. Let's go drink some water. Slam it. Oh my God. I think I lost all my water weight on this mat. Remember, dehydration is the main killer of energy and fat loss. You're dehydrated. Your body don't, your body don't work. You know what I mean? It's dead. Woo! All right. Let's show you this next round. All right, we got glute bridge, hip bridge. 30 seconds per side. That's going to be lovely. Now we're going to do reverse flies, but we're going to do shoulder circles. So we're going to burn that, be in that reverse fly position. And we're going to do shoulder circles. Then we're going to hop on our back, do supermans. Then we're going to do side plank crunches, 30 seconds per side. Okay. So we got glutes with that glute bridge, hip bridge, reverse flies for the upper back, back of the shoulders, supermans for the lower back and the whole posterior chain. And then we got side plank crunch for the obliques. All righty. Let's get started. 10 seconds. Now I have a bench over here. I'm gonna use that bench for my glute bridge. You can use on the floor. You can lay on the floor and do them. But I'm gonna use that bench, it's a little more effective for me. 
All right, five, four, three, two, and begin. Now I'm just gonna use body weight for now. All right, one leg at a time, driving all the way up, squeezing the butt. Oh, that feels great. Trying to make a tabletop coming up all the way. Oh, that burns. Squeeze those glutes. Hold it at the top. Five, four, three, two, and switch legs. Nice and quick transition. Feeling the glutes, the hamstrings, the calves. Oh, it feels great. My favorite exercise for isolating the back of the legs and the butt. I really feel this one. Hold it five, four, three, two. And we got those reverse flies. I'm going to use these five pound weights. I'm doing circles. So I'm in that bent over position. Circles. Oh, yeah. Make sure you do both directions. That feels great. Slow reps. And drop it down. I'm just going to hold that position. Oh, oh burning. Up as high as you can. Flex as hard as you can. You should really feel this whole body on this one. And side plank. I'm gonna do crunch. Hands behind the head. Tuck in. Come back out. Tuck in. Come back out. 30 seconds. It's quick. So make sure you're transitioning quickly. Make sure you're hustling. Otherwise, your workout's gonna be mediocre. Oh, yes. And switch sides. Look how fast that was. Fast transition. Fifteen seconds. And right back up, loop bridge. Let's go. I'm going to add fifteen pounds. Oh yeah, there we go. That's even more challenging. A little bit of weight on the hip. Oh. A little faster rep pace. Hold it. Five, four, three, two. Switch legs. Look at that. Zero transition time. Very quick. Squeezing at the top. Explosive on the way up. And hold it. Five, four, three, two. And reverse fly, shoulder circles. Nice. Squeezing that mid back. Both directions. I'm sweating, dripping sweat. And Superman, I'm gonna hold on to these little five pound weights. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be hard. Uh, oh, wow, I feel that even more. Holy cow. Every muscle on my back. Woo! 
Come on, 10 more seconds. Hold it, squeeze. And side plank crunch. Fast transition. Fast. Pulling that knee all the way to the elbow. Oh, I feel those obliques. Switch sides. We're getting a water break after this, so enjoy it. And grab your water. 30 seconds, quickly, quickly. Oh, wow. Look at my water jug. I started here. I'm already here. Ooh. All right, let's take up this intensity. We're gonna do sumo squat jumps. For the first 30 seconds, we're going to do sumo, squat, jumps, for these first 30 seconds, all right? Get started. Come on, 10 seconds. And hip bridge. Fast, 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 fast. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, now my heart rate's screaming. Oh, I feel my glutes, my hamstrings. Oh, my goodness. I am on fire. Hold it. Five. Four, three, two, switch legs, drop it out. Wrap it out. All the way up. Oh my gosh. And hold it. Five. Four, three, two, and reverse flies. Good set. Good set. I like that intensity. Give me regular reverse flies, like just regular reps up and down. We're not doing shoulder circles. Regular reps. Point your thumbs up to the ceiling when you're doing this. Thumbs up. Hold it. Hold it at the top. And Superman. I'm going to mimic a press. So I'm going to hold it at the top, press forward, come back. Press forward, come back. Oh my gosh. I totally get those back muscles. Oh. Oh. oh, wow, that burns. I can't even do more than two in a row. Oh, slow reps. Squeezing stomach. You gotta flex the stomach while you're in this position, too. Oh my gosh. Oh, and side plank. Let's go. I'm gonna do a straight leg. Coming up, straight leg. Oh, way harder. Oh. My obliques and my back muscles are screaming at me to say stop because they're burning. But I don't stop. 
when it burns. I get through that burn. I'm not weak. I'm strong. Ugh. Switch sides. Same thing. Keep those legs straight if you can. Oh, yeah. And sumo squat jump. Let's go. Come on, 30 seconds. Adding that intensity. Come on, work on that depth. Make sure you're getting parallel. Don't be skipping on that. Get airborne. At the bare minimum, give me reps. Just reps. Oh my goodness. It's not burning. And hold that sumo squat halfway. Hold it. Oh, come on, fire. Squeeze those glutes. Come on. Woo. This feels amazing. Thank you for letting me join you on this amazing workout. I love the challenge. Come on, stay down with me. Come on, 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, and hit bridge. Come on, quick, 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 hit bridge. Let's go. I'm using the weight. Squeezing those butts at the top. Oh my gosh. You know, I suffer along with you guys. I wanna suffer along with you because I know that growth happens through a challenge. You get weak if you're unchallenged, physically weak, mentally weak. Hold it at the top. Five, four, three, two, switch legs. And I never want to be weak physically or mentally. I want to be strong for you guys, strong for my family, strong, most importantly, for myself. Because I know that my life is worth it. And that my effort I put in directly translates to my life. No effort, no life. Good effort, rewarding. Hold it. Five, four, three, two, and reverse flies. Let's go. Give me those shoulder circles. Oh, yes. I can feel these ones in my mid back, my lower back, all my muscles. Oh. Woo. We need to stand up, take a break for five seconds, and get back into it. Shoulder circles, not hold it. Just hold it. Hold it. Squeeze those middle back muscles. Now rotate your wrists. Rotate your wrists. Look at me. Rotate those wrists. Uh, rotator cuff, baby. Woo! And Superman. I'm gonna try some weighted presses. Oh, I don't know how long, I don't know how good it's gonna work, but I'm gonna try it. Pick up my five pound weights. Press. 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 Oh my gosh. I'm gonna drop down to body weight. That was a little too hard. <laughs> Gotta modify. Always modify. Instead of just resting and chilling. Oh, wow. And just hold it at the top. Hold it. Hold it. Oh, my lower back muscles are feeling great. Come on, five, four, three, two. And side plank crunch. I'm going to put a 15 pound weight on my side while doing this crunch. Oh my gosh, even harder. Ah, you gotta balance that weight on you. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm just gonna hold it. I'm just gonna hold it. Ah. Ah. And switch sides. Woo. Oh, here we go. Crunches. Oh. 
Oh. I'm just gonna hold it. Oh, with this weight, a little pulses up and down. Oh. Come on, five, four, three, two. And everybody can do top jumps. Let's go, top jumps. Oh my gosh, that's killer. I'm on fire right now. My heart rate, my legs. Come on, 15 seconds. Ten, nine, eight, woo! One, two more. Ah, it's hot. Holy cow. I just kicked my ass. Holy cow. That was, that was amazing. All right, guys. Water. Drink it. My heart rate is sky high. If yours isn't, you gotta push it. Gotta push it, whatever fitness level you're at. Woo, enjoy that water. All right. Next group. Next group. Oh, this is. This is gonna be my favorite group. I'm looking forward to this group. Really looking forward to this group. Single leg deadlift. Okay, single leg deadlift. 30 seconds per leg. Yeah, that's right, shirt's coming off. Single leg, single arm row. Single leg, single arm row, 30 seconds. Per side. Doesn't matter what leg, doesn't matter what arm, as long as you get it in. All right. And then finally, we got triangles. My favorite exercise for the obliques and the lower back. Like one of my faves. All right, let's get started. Ten seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and begin. Single leg deadlift. Okay, right here. Stay balanced on that one leg. Control. Oh, this one's my favorite exercise. I love single leg stuff. Oh, feeling those muscles in the back, the hamstrings. The calves, the feet, working on balance, stability, coordination. Woo! Switch legs. Imagine digging your big foot, your big toe, into the floor. Dig that big toe into the floor. Get some balance. All right, single arm, single leg row. So my left leg is on the floor, and my right leg, and my right hand is rowing. Oh my gosh. Left leg, right hand. Holy cow. Wow. Totally targets the lower back as well. I'm burning. Oh, this one's killer. Switch legs, switch arms. So now my right leg and my left hand are working together. Oh my goodness. It's okay if you need to hold on to something at first. Get that balance. Oh yeah, that's a tough one. And triangles, 
Let's go. Reaching down, touch the floor. Look at how my, my left foot is turned out and my right foot is straight. Okay, I'm reaching down to that turned out foot. All the way down. Great for flexibility, mobility, switch sides, switch foot positions. Now look at my right foot turned out, my left foot straight. Reaching down. Balancing that weight above the head. And sing it like that. Let's, let's go. Balance. Posture. Shoulders back. Body straight. Look at my body. There's a straight line between my shoulders and my heel. Right? I'm not rounding my back like this. Right? My body's nice and straight. Oh my gosh. And I need to work on my balance. Switch legs. Switch legs. Oh, I'm dripping sweat. Sounds like it's raining in here. But nope, it's just me sweating, feeling hot and sexy. That's right. Whew. Come on, 10 seconds. That's it. Digging my big toe into the ground to help balance. Now, single leg, single arm row. I do my right leg and my right hand growing. My right leg is on the floor and my right hand is growing. I did the opposite last round. Wow. My muscles are screaming right now. Especially my muscles and my calves, my legs, my back, my lats. Woo! Switch arms, switch legs. Left leg on the floor, left hand growing. <sighs> Gotta work on that balance. Oh, wow. I'm getting my butt whooped, guys. I gotta be honest, but it feels good. Feels good. I wouldn't have it any other way. Otherwise, it wouldn't be worth my time. And try tools. This time we're gonna do it differently. We're gonna look up at that top weight. So looking up. That previous set I was looking forward. This set I'm looking up. Looking up helps keep the body straight and targets the obliques. Looking forward, you target the lower back a little bit. Looking up at that weight, watching it like a hot guy, making sure it's straight up, making sure I'm going all the way down. One more rep. Ah, switch sides. Same concept. Looking up at that weight. Woo, this side's a little tighter. One side might be a little tighter, a little bit harder. That's okay. That's okay. I like that. Oh, nice and controlled, using those obliques, back muscles. Oh, yeah. Last one. And grab some water. Let's go quickly. This is your water break. Enjoy it. Because you know what we're going to do, right? Single leg burpee. Let's go. Come on. Single leg burpee. Oh. Stay on that same leg. Remember, I talked about bringing up the intensity on the last two sets. 
Training strategically. Smart. So that you have a better workout. You have better results. You feel better. Oh, switch legs. Other leg. Right into those things like that. Let's go. Quick transition. Now, don't let your form get sloppy. Keep your form tight. Body straight. Controlled. Focus. Never get sloppy when you're fatigued. That's when injuries happen. Switch legs. And nobody wants injuries, right? We want to train for our whole life. You know, we don't want to just train until we get injured and quit, become overweight and unhappy, right? Nobody wants that. I'm here to train for my life so that I can do the stuff that I want to. I keep up with my future kids, keep up with anybody, keep up with myself. And single leg, single arm row. Left leg on the floor, right hand rowing. Left leg on the floor, right hand rowing. Oh my goodness. This is taking it out of me. Woo! This one's a tough one. You know, I told myself I couldn't wait for this one because I knew it was going to be difficult. And boy, oh boy, was I right. This one's the hardest group. Switch legs, switch arms, right arm, left hand. Oh, yeah. Dig that big toe into the ground. Balance. Oh, yeah, squeeze at the top of that row. Holy cow, I'm burning. And show me those triangles. So I'm going to be looking forward this round. I'm looking forward. I'm not looking up. A okay, different position. Full reps. All the way down. Don't ever skip on reps. Like when you're going halfway down, if you can only go halfway down, okay, I get it. But work on those full range slowly, all the way down. Control it. It'll be better for you, I promise. One more rep. And switch sides. Switch sides. All the way down. Oh, yeah. Again, look at my foot position. The, the hand that's reaching down, that foot is turned out. And the other foot is straight. Helps get that depth. You can also separate the feet to make it easier. Although, I don't want to make it easier. I don't want to make it harder. All right, boys and girls. We've got that single leg burpee. I'm going to add a tuck jump to it. Good luck, John. Oh, yeah. Next level. Holy cow. That's killer. One more. Switch legs. Got to add that tuck jump if you can. Single leg. Top jump. Oh, you can do a two leg top jump if you want. Come on, one more rep. One more. And deadlift. Single leg deadlift. Let's go.
My heart rate is screaming. It's probably 180 right now. Oh my goodness. See how that last set was the most intense? Building up intensity. Feels great. I feel like I can attack my day. Now, uh, finish this workout. Right? Switch legs. Other side. Transition quickly. That's what it's about. And thank you guys for working out with me today. I love it. Grateful to have you guys and my crew working with me. Because this ain't no joke. It's tough getting in shape. It's challenging. Not only physically, but mentally. All right, single leg row. I'm gonna do right leg, right arm. Right leg on the floor, right arm row. Ooh, it's tough. It's tough mentally to get this workout in every day. Three times a week, four times a week. You know, it's not easy. So I commend you coming in here, working hard with me. I wanna be surrounded by you guys every day of my life. Thank you for that. Switch arms, switch legs. Left leg, left arm. Oh, this one feels great. Five seconds, four, three, two, and triangles. I'm gonna look up. I'm looking up on this rep, on this round. Get those obliques. Full range. Oh, this is one of my favorite exercises for mobility, for shoulder stability, obliques and lower back health. Talk about one of the best exercises you could do. It's not a glamorous exercise, but it protects you a lot. Come on, one more rep. One more rep. Ah, and switch sides. Look up at that weight. Ten seconds. Two more reps. Two more. Come on. One more. All right, guys. Last minute. I'm gonna do a weighted single leg burpee tuck jump. Woo! Let's do it. Oh yeah. Last minute. Going all out. Come on, one more rep on this leg. One more. And switch legs. Come on, last 30 seconds. Two more. Come on. One more. And time. Oh, my God. Ah, that was brutal. That was brutal. Oh, my goodness. Boys and girls, that kicks my ass. Thank you for that workout. Let's see. Let's drink some water. Wow. How are we feeling? How are we feeling? Good. Thanks. Yeah, that's good. All right. <laughs> Check out that water bottle. 
Where was I when I started? Look it up. Yep. Right here. Right? About a half a gallon. Again, that's my consistency. Try to get a half a gallon in my workout. Because I'm sweating it out anyway. I'm sweating this water out. The more you drink, the more you sweat. That's a good sign. Sweating is your body cooling itself off. Right? Yeah. Woo! I did a bottle and a half of this, so that's pretty good during a workout. <laughs> nice. That's great. It's 36. Nice. You did, um, you did one and a half of that? Yeah. Damn. That's good. You just hit 50, 60 ounces, 50 ounces. That's great. That's yeah, almost a half a gallon 30. right there. Good job. All right, guys, I'm proud of you. Thank you for joining me. You guys killed it today. You guys are going to have a better day because you killed this workout. Thank you. Sounds good. See you later.